Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, even a dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell so you find out whenever I post new videos, announce giveaways, or go live. Do be on the lookout. I will have some giveaways coming up in celebration of my first two years here on YouTube very, very soon in just a couple days. As always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being being here and welcome back. Today I have another fun box from The Craft and Tea Box, which is exactly what it sounds like. Each month you are sent a different craft kit as well as a premium tea so you can enjoy a little me time and sort of stoke your creativity. So far I've opened two of these boxes and I have had so much fun doing the crafts. So I will definitely post some images for you over on Instagram once I get around to whatever this month's craft is. This box was sent to me for review. It is the set September box. I do believe you might have one day left if it's still August to subscribe and get this particular box. But if you ever see a craft that you may have missed from past boxes, now they have their classics collection. So you can always peruse that in their shop online and find out if you can get any of those boxes if they do have any left in stock. So this box is actually out of Canada. It is 49 Canadian each month and that's about 41 US at the current conversion rate. The shipping within Can Canada is $6.96. The shipping to the US I believe is about $8.95 which is around $7.50 so you can get this box shipped to you for under $50 US if you are looking into it but like I said it is really fun. Um, no pressure on like being perfect or having an artistic masterpiece at the end. It's really just for you to enjoy and maybe try something that you haven't before without having to go and buy like a ton of supplies right. They give you enough to do at least one project. So let's go ahead and get into to it. I'm just seeing some tissue paper. I'm going to open that up and of course you guys know I do enjoy tea. I don't do a lot of strictly tea boxes because I get so much tea in other subscriptions but I'm very happy to have it with this craft box. I think it is a really really nice pairing that she has put together. So this is our lovely craft and tea box. So this is what the little uh, insert looks like. It tells us that this month's craft is embroidery. This is exciting. I have to uh, try my hand at embroidery. I actually have some embroidery kits from another subscription, a book subscription actually, and I haven't delved into those yet so maybe this will get me going. And it does say that we have a tea that is called Spa Day. That sounds really really nice. So let's find out a little bit more about it. So they tell us a little bit more about the craft on one side of this second insert and then they tell us a lot about the tea on the other side. So let me go ahead and start with the tea. Mine came in this very pretty box. It got a little bit, little bit mushed but I can put it back into shape. This is from the Beauty Tea collection, of course, or Boti um, Spa Day Journey at the Spa or O Spa. So, of course, this does come out of Canada, so we get some French in there as well. We got 15 biodegradable tea sachets in here, you guys. I actually really love when we get tea sachets. I know loose leaf tea is beautiful and you can have all kinds of fun, fancy diffusers, but sometimes just for the ease of it, I like a nice, good tea sachet and it does make me feel better knowing that it is biodegradable. So, Let's read about Spa Day. Sounds good already. It says, Tealish. It says, when we discovered how unbelievably delicious and healthy premium loose leaf tea was, we were 25 years old, loved cooking, traveling, health and wellness, and had both just graduated from university. The world was at our feet and we both knew one thing. We wanted to sign up for entrepreneurship and all it entailed. The vision for Tealish came when we realized there were no retail experiences that presented tea in a fun, fresh, and modern way. There would be tea lattes, tea smoothies, freshly shaken iced teas, and over 100 gourmet loose leaf teas to choose from. Wow, that sounds really good. A tea latte right now sounds delicious. Uh, and that's from Laura and Mike, who are behind Tealish Fine Teas, about this particular tea. It says, soothing herbs of lemongrass, licorice, and peppermint marry with mellow linden flower to guide you on the path to relaxation and rejuvenation, bringing the spa to you. So of course it is caffeine free. There are rare occasions where I need a caffeine free tea, especially I have found myself doing a lot of these crafts in the evening, so it's probably not a good thing for me to be necessarily caffeinating even more at the end of the day. Key benefits are that it is hydrating, stress relieving, and promotes peacefulness. So I know some people are not like fans of licorice, but I think I can feel like how that herbal essence in there would somehow add to that spa quality, making it feel like it's really good for you. Of course, I love peppermint and I love lemongrass, and that was the first listed 
flavor. So I think it's going to be delicious. I will try to take some photos for you guys over on Instagram because this is kind of nice because I can actually just open one of the sachets to give it a try instead of sort of committing to brewing an entire pot of tea. So then let's take a look at our craft, which is embroidery. So I'm hoping they gave us a nice pattern because I, I don't know if I could draw this myself. So it just came in this package like this. So it says this is from Kindred Spirit Art Studio. So let me see if I can get into this uh, little package. I'm sure I can. It says they are based in Vancouver. We are a mother and daughter team who believe that everyone has the ability to be creative and most importantly, while having a whole lot of fun doing it. So let me just go ahead and get this open. And of course, this is sort of a tea inspired pattern. It's got some little punched out hearts in there for a little added decor. So we did get a nice hoop, right? So it comes apart and then you screw that tight. You can kind of see where it's split. Um, I, that, that much I know so far. But here is what our image looks like. It is a teapot with a floral design and then it says make life beautiful or beautiful. So that is what that looks like. Pretty simple in terms of the outline. I'll have to get good at doing my outline without a lot of like gaps in between. So it looks like it does tell us a lot of information. There's just four colors. There's a color key. So it's almost like embroidery by numbers, which is great. And it does tell us it like with this diagram, it tells you what kind of stitch for each of those components. So running stitch, three strands. Oh, it even tells you. So it looks like they may have actually pre-cut it. It says, remember to separate your threads into two or three strands before stitching. This pattern is designed for one, two or three strands according to the level of detail. Using six strands may give a rather heavy effect and leave not enough thread to finish. So I, oh, okay. So you actually do like together two or three strands, but not, not more than that. So it says use your mini leaflet quick guide embroidery stitches as you sew. So I'm going to have to do some uh, definite investigation. So this is nice. This must be our booklet quick guide embroidery stitches it's just kind of like accordion like this and it actually gives you a good idea you know tells you the basics right what a running stitch is what a seed stitch is so this is very important i will have to look over that first and then look over this diagram and see what kinds of stitches i need to know so that i am prepared and uh then i'm then I'll, I guess I'll, I'll dive into it. So then there is even more information. It says, we hope you enjoy stitching this specially made in Canada embroidery design. Don't be daunted if you're a beginner. There's no correct way to create and you can use the most basic stitches to complete your design. As you become more confident, search online for video tutorials and start experimenting with new ones. We're big on developing individual individuality. The important thing is that you enjoy using your hands in the process of stitching and feel a sense of achievement on completing a little work of embroidery art that is uniquely your own. So that is a little bit <laughs> consoling. I appreciate them telling us that we can do it uh, so that they believe in us. So it says this kit includes one cotton fabric with your printed design. Oh, yay. It's got the design printed on it. One embroidery hoop, one embroidery needle, more than enough thread in the suggested colors using the strands as recommended. So and then it does say their website, of course. Let's see. It's got some other information about their studio. Like, for example, it says how to set up your hoop, your needle and thread. Um, it says each bundle will contain pieces of thread containing six strands. We suggest using two strands to embroider this pattern. Okay, that makes sense. But they are saying that you can use one strand sometimes where it looks a little bit more detailed. So here are our embroidery threads. So it does look like we have plenty. I like that they kept it all um, divided for us. So I'll have to double check and, and look into it a little bit more. What they mean by, if they mean the actual how each thread has like Six small ones I'm not sure I, don't, I would doubt that you would like split that up or if they mean that you actually bundle them together I don't know enough about embroidery you guys someone someone will have to tell me but I definitely appreciate that they have this design pre-printed on here which is nice so I won't have to sort of like eyeball it or try to pencil something in there so that is awesome I'm just I'm a little confused like I said it says suggest using two strands to embroider this pattern however feel free to use one strand in areas okay so yeah it is so it says each length of thread is 18 to 20 inches long and the colors correspond to the colors on the pattern 
chart, we find that this is a good length to avoid tangling or knotting while sewing. So they have taken a lot of the work out of it. I will, like I said, have to do a little bit of research before I dive in and get brave enough. I'm not sure if this is the kind of art necessarily that I would hang up on my own wall just because I don't drink like that much tea, but it is certainly going to be fun to learn how to do embroidery with it. And then maybe I will feel a little bit more confident to tackle the other embroidery kits that I have that don't have such great instructions. So that is a fun item. So let's see a little bit more about Kindred Spirit Art Studio. Like I said, it says joy is one of the ingredients to good health and well-being. And with this shop, we aim to share our passion in finding that joy through self-expression, experimentation, and having fun. All you need is the opportunity, a little me time, and the willingness to let go of expectations and just go for it. The great thing is there's no right or wrong in creating. You make the rules. We operate an eco-friendly, Canada-connected business using only natural materials and sustainable methods. We do whatever we can to take care of the planet while going about our business activities. And that's from Shirley and Joe. And that is their little bunny emblem, which I think is adorable so you guys let me know if you are embroidery experts give me some hints in the comments below I definitely appreciate it if you are looking for a little creative outlet as well as some delicious tea this might be a really fun box to try and if you have any other suggestions for DIY boxes or craft boxes you would like me to review on this channel please do let me know if you are interested in subscribing I almost forgot you guys I do have a code for you it's Noel 20 and that will save you 20% I will definitely leave that in the description box below as always. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you soon in my next unboxing.